Are you ready to dominate the battlefield and carve out victory for Super Earth? Then you've landed in the perfect spot. Welcome to the definitive guide on mastering Helldivers 2, a game where your strategy can turn the tide of war. In the vast universe of Helldivers 2, selecting the right stratagems isn't just a part of the game, it's the heartbeat of survival. Each choice you make, from the weapons you carry to the backup you call, shapes your journey through hostile alien territories. Today, we're diving deep into the arsenal of Helldivers 2, focusing on the most effective stratagems that ensure your triumph against the relentless enemies of Super Earth. Whether you're strategizing to obliterate bug nests or maneuvering through cyborg fortifications, the right set of tools can elevate your game from mere survival to absolute domination. Let's embark on this journey together and transform you into the ultimate defender of humanity's last bastion of hope. In the fierce battles for Super Earth, your choice of support weapons can turn the tide against the alien hordes. Let's dive into the top support weapons in Helldivers 2, each tailored for different situations on the battlefield. Machine Gun Your first companion in the chaos, the machine gun, is accessible from the start. Its high rate of fire and formidable damage output make it an excellent choice for cutting through enemy ranks. Best used when you're on the move, its suppressive fire can keep enemies at bay while your squad maneuvers. Expendable Anti-Tank Launcher As you ascend through the ranks, the Expendable Anti-Tank Launcher becomes an indispensable tool against the game's behemoths. With just one shot per launcher, but two units dropped per call, it's your go-to for delivering devastating blows every 70 seconds. Timing and positioning are key. Use it to ambush larger foes when they least expect it. Recoilless Rifle For those who prefer precision, the recoilless rifle offers a balance of power and challenge. Its hefty reload time is a drawback, necessitating teamwork for efficient use. Pair up with a squadmate to handle reloading duties, and you'll find it invaluable for taking down armored targets from a safe distance. Grenade Launcher Objective-focused players will find the Grenade Launcher a game-changer. Perfect for clearing out entrenched enemies and bug nests, its area damage ensures you can hit multiple targets with a single shot. Use it when you're holding a position or need to quickly disrupt enemy formations. Autocannon The autocannon steps up the game with its ammo efficiency, making it a superior choice for dealing with large enemies and objectives. While it demands an ammo backpack for sustained use, its high damage output justifies the investment. Coordination with your team to cover while you unleash hell is crucial. Arc Thrower Often underestimated, the Arc Thrower shines in crowd control. Its streams of electricity leap between targets, dealing consistent damage and bypassing armor. Ideal for clearing swarms of smaller enemies, its unlimited ammo is a boon. Beware of its indiscriminate nature, ensure your team is clear of its path to avoid friendly fire. Railgun The crown jewel of support weapons, the railgun, combines power and precision like no other. Though it requires reaching level 20 for access, its ability to penetrate armor and deliver high damage with quick reloads makes it worth the grind. Use it to snipe high-value targets, supporting your team from a distance. Each of these weapons has its place in the Helldiver's arsenal. The key to maximizing their effectiveness lies in understanding their strengths and limitations, choosing the right moment to deploy them, and coordinating with your squad for optimal impact. Experiment with each to find your perfect match and become the savior Super Earth needs. Beyond the firepower, your survival in Helldivers too often hinges on the gear you carry on your back. Supply backpacks are crucial for sustaining your fight against the enemies of Super Earth. Let's explore the essential backpacks and how to leverage them in combat. Supply Pack Starting with the basics, the Supply Pack is a must-have for every Helldiver. Equipped with four resupplies and the ability to refill via the resupply stratagem, this backpack is your lifeline. It ensures your weapons are always ready, and your grenades and stims are topped off. Ideal for extended engagements, keep it close when using ammo-hungry weapons like the railgun. Sharing supplies with teammates can turn the tide of any battle, making this backpack a staple in cooperative play. Guard Dog Rover When the battlefield gets overwhelming, the Guard Dog Rover steps in. Different from its ballistic counterpart, this variant uses relentless laser ammo to cut through smaller foes, allowing you to focus on the bigger threats. It's a game-changer for crowd control, especially effective against Terminants. Position it strategically to maximize its damage output without worrying about reloads or cooldowns. 
The constant laser barrage provides a protective barrier, making it an excellent choice for both offensive pushes and defensive stands. Shield Generator Pack Facing off against the automatons requires more than just firepower, you need defense. The Shield Generator Pack offers just that. Capable of absorbing hits from formidable enemies, it's a beacon of safety amidst chaos. With a quick self-repair feature, it's invaluable for higher difficulty missions where survival is paramount. While it occupies your backpack slot, the trade-off for enhanced durability can be well worth it, especially in scenarios where dodging is not an option. Use it to hold your ground, protect objectives, or as a buffer during risky maneuvers. Each of these supply backpacks serves a unique purpose, from ensuring you're always battle-ready with the supply pack, to offering automated defense with the Guard Dog Rover, and bolstering your survivability with a Shield Generator Pack. The key to their effective use lies in anticipating the challenges of each mission and adapting your loadout accordingly. Experiment with these backpacks to find the perfect balance for your playstyle and mission requirements, ensuring Super Earth's victory one deployment at a time. In the heart-pounding world of Helldivers 2, offensive stratagems are your keys to delivering devastating blows to the enemies of Super Earth. Let's dissect the most powerful stratagems you can unleash and how to deploy them for maximum battlefield impact. Orbital Precision Strike A cornerstone of any Helldivers arsenal, the Orbital Precision Strike is available early but remains potent throughout your campaign. Its precise, high damage output makes it perfect for taking out key targets or breaking enemy lines. Utilize this when enemy clusters are immobilized or when you've got a clear shot at strategic objectives. Timing and accuracy are crucial. Mark your targets carefully to avoid friendly fire and maximize destruction. Eagle Airstrike For broader engagement, the Eagle Airstrike covers a significant area, decimating ranks of lesser foes with ease. It's especially effective in open spaces where its wide damage radius can be fully exploited. Ideal for clearing out enemy encampments or providing a quick escape route, deploy it when you've got room to breathe and a clear target area. Coordination with your team ensures you get the most out of this stratagem without compromising your positions. 500 kg bomb. The behemoth of bombs, the Eagle 500 kg bomb, packs an unparalleled punch. Its massive explosion radius and devastating power make it the ultimate choice for eliminating large groups of enemies or heavily fortified positions. Given its limited use, save this for the most challenging encounters or when facing down enemy bosses. Communication with your squad is key to ensure its optimal use and to keep allies out of the blast zone. Orbital Gatling Barrage For sustained area denial, the Orbital Gatling Barrage is unmatched. It blankets a targeted area with relentless gunfire, shredding through enemy ranks and making it nearly impossible for foes to advance. Deploy it to protect objectives, cover retreats, or control enemy movement. Its duration makes it ideal for holding points while you regroup or reload, but be mindful of its placement to avoid cutting off your own escape routes. Orbital Laser The pinnacle of offensive technology, the Orbital Laser, offers precision and power. Targeting the biggest threats within its range, it systematically dismantles enemy defenses, making it a game-changer in tight situations. Use it to break sieges, support assaults, or turn the tide in pitched battles. Its ability to track and destroy makes it particularly effective against high-value targets. Plan its deployment to coincide with major engagements where its impact will be most felt. Mastering these offensive stratagems requires not just knowledge of their capabilities, but a strategic mindset to deploy them effectively. Anticipate enemy movements, communicate with your team, and choose the right moment to call down your firepower. With these tools at your disposal, you'll be a force of liberation across the galaxy, one stratagem at a time. In the relentless war for Super Earth in Helldivers 2, defensive measures are just as crucial as offensive firepower. Defensive stratagems provide the strategic depth needed to protect objectives and ensure your team's survival. Let's explore the fortifications you can deploy to keep the enemy at bay. Machine Gun Sentry A reliable first line of defense, the Machine Gun Sentry is both affordable and effective. Its rapid fire capability makes it excellent for mowing down infantry and providing cover while you focus on more significant threats. Place it strategically to cover choke points or defend objectives. Its vulnerability to heavy fire means it should be positioned where it can surprise the enemy, rather than directly in the line of advance. Mortar Sentry 
For a more explosive approach, the mortar sentry brings high-powered ordnance to the field. Best used in situations where you anticipate clusters of enemies, it can obliterate groups with its powerful blasts. Due to its potential for friendly fire, it's paramount to deploy it at a safe distance from your squad, preferably covering areas where the enemy is likely to mass. M's Mortar Sentry An evolution of the Mortar Sentry, the M's version adds a layer of crowd control by stunning enemies within its blast radius. This makes it invaluable for holding objectives against waves of attackers, giving you and your team time to react and counterattack. Use it to create bottlenecks or to protect areas of strategic importance, ensuring enemies are kept at a standstill. Tesla Tower The Tesla Tower is a marvel of Heldiver engineering, providing a static defense that zaps any enemy that comes too close. Its ability to lock down areas makes it perfect for defending narrow passages or key objectives. However, its indiscriminate nature requires careful placement to avoid incapacitating your team. Use it to secure flanks or guard rear areas, making it difficult for the enemy to approach without getting shocked. Deploying these defensive stratagems effectively requires anticipation of enemy movements and a keen sense of the battlefield layout. Position them to maximize their effectiveness and always be mindful of their potential to affect both friend and foe. With these defenses in your arsenal, you'll turn the tide of battle, creating impenetrable fortresses wherever you stand. As we conclude our comprehensive journey through the best stratagems in Heldiverse 2, it's clear that the key to securing Super Earth's safety lies not just in the weapons we wield, but in the strategies we deploy. From the relentless firepower of support weapons to the indispensable utility of supply backpacks, the devastating impact of offensive stratagems, and the unwavering defense provided by defensive stratagems, each plays a pivotal role in our quest for victory. The beauty of Heldiverse 2 lies in its diversity of tools and tactics, offering a myriad of ways to engage with and overcome the challenges it presents. Whether you prefer the direct approach of decimating foes with the orbital laser or the strategic depth of fortifying positions with the Tesla Tower, the game encourages creativity and experimentation. It's this variety that ensures no two missions feel the same, and that every Heldiver can find their unique way to contribute to the cause. But the arsenal we've explored today is just the beginning. Heldivers 2 is a game of depth and complexity, with each stratagem offering new ways to collaborate with your squad and adapt to the ever-evolving threats you face. The most effective Heldivers are those who are willing to experiment, to adapt, and to learn not just from their victories, but also from their defeats. Now, it's your turn to dive into the fray, to test these stratagems for yourself, and to discover the combinations that best suit your playstyle. The battlefield of Heldivers 2 is an unforgiving place, but it's also one of opportunity. Opportunity to become a hero, to save Super Earth, and to write your name in the annals of its history. We'd love to hear about your experiences on the battlefield. What stratagems have you found most effective? Are there any hidden gems that you've discovered in your campaigns? Share your stories and strategies in the comments below. Your insights not only enrich our community, but also pave the way for future victories. And if you found this guide helpful, consider subscribing for more Heldiverse 2 content. Your support helps us bring more strategies, tips, and guides to the forefront, aiding fellow Heldivers in their mission to protect humanity. Don't forget to hit the like button if you're ready to stand up against the enemies of Super Earth. Together, we are stronger. Together, we can ensure the safety of our home. Dive in, Heldivers for Super Earth. Livers for Super Earth. Livers for Super Earth.